All right, welcome back to some TFT with me, McGrathy. Don't want ghostly crest. I kind of like cluttered mind, but I kind of want the crown guarded. To be honest, I'm going to be going Diana, not a um, shock to anybody who has been watching me for the last couple of days. Um, just briefly to explain, I will be doing um, a heavenly series, basically, and this is. A series of games uh, where I play Diana and I force a Diana comp of some kind and I'm, the point is Diana is sort of a flex um, champion she's really good in so many different scenarios because of this 14.9 patch um, the bonus that she gets from uh, say heavenly uh, is increased by 70% which is awesome uh, if she has the spat so we're gonna try and get the spat we started with the spatula augment um, so We'll start with that, and that'll be good. Um, so yeah, we're gonna try Diana. We're, again, forcing her. Um, this is not maybe something I would do in ranked, necessarily. I would probably be a little bit more flexible than even this in ranked. Um, so for instance, I'm just going to be trying to get uh, Diana. I'm not gonna be trying to get anything else. Um, I probably wouldn't do that if I was playing ranked to try and, you know, get LP or something like that. I would be following a pretty specific, you know, set of rules if I was playing that but I'm not and like people have pointed out I'm terrible at the game and uh, that's pretty normal my wife tells me all the time that I'm bad at games and I should re retire and not do it um, I get that no problem uh, I'm okay with that but I'm just here to dick around and have fun so if you like dicking around and having fun uh, stick around we could have fun here um, it's yeah it's not about gaining LP, this is about finding out what good comps are. And later, maybe this is about finding good, you know, comps. Maybe later we find out just how good some of these comps can be. And uh, that's totally fine. But for now, uh, I'm not too worried about it. We're probably lost streaking a little bit here. We have a pretty good comp, but it's not amazing. Uh, I mean, you know, getting the Soraka early is really... She actually might three-shot these, or one-shot these guys. Uh, she didn't kill two of them. But she might kill two of them, but that's fine. We don't have our item on anybody yet, which is hard. Uh, makes it more difficult. <clears throat> and I don't want to put it on Nico because I want to keep Nico. Uh, invokers, duelists, or three cost. I kind of like invokers, but then we're going to get. Hmm. I think we take the three costs. Because we want Diana. Ah, we didn't get it. But we did get an invoker, so that's one thing. Uh, we also might want this later. So, yeah, we're going to sell these guys, and sell these guys, and probably sell this. And I might sell this as well, because I actually don't don't actually need any of these. We don't want a ghostly emblem. Um, I do need a unit to go to be the Diana until we get Diana, so like I'll take Alawi, for instance, would be really good. Uh, this guy's got a three-star Cho'Gath already? What did you get? Oh, heroic grab bag? Did you use it? Oh my god, you used a heroic grab bag on that? He's also trying to get this. I'm guessing he's going some sort of uh, heavenly as well. Uh, he just doesn't have his units yet. Yeah. Sorry, Zyra, I will find you later. <coughs> um, Exalted's here for us are terrible. Soraka's the only one that we would use in this comp. The rest we would never use in, under any circumstance, so... I'm not going to be going heavenly. Usually, if, if you go Diana Flex, there's usually at least two or three good heavenly units for you, but uh, in this case, there's not. So, I'm not going to worry about it. I want to pick up this Tom Kench probably uh, for the bruiser, or sorry, for the uh, blue buff. Um, but if I don't get it, I'll take something else. That's fine. I would have taken the Kha'Zix as well, would have been okay. Would have three star or two starred my Kha'Zix and given me a. Um, uh, a needlessly large rod, but um, this is fine. I actually might go three crown guard if I can. It would be nice. Um, but the Spear of Shojin might be really good. Um, so, yeah, we might go there. Okay, there's the Diana. Nice. We got it. That's what we want. Um, I guess we put her in for this for now. We put the crown guard on her. I don't need a mythic emblem. And I don't want the Spear of Shojin quite yet. I might actually make... Um, I don't know, I might make a redemption for her. I haven't decided yet. I think this spear is probably okay on Soraka, right? I think it is. Let's just do it. Let's send it. It's fine. We're playing games. We're having fun, guys. This is just dicking around. Um, yeah. 
So Diana, why do I think Diana is amazing? Well, she's a dragon lord. Dragon lords are probably the best comp right now. Um, they're just, they're really, really good. Um, Sage is also really good. At five Sage, if you can get the emblem, um, she actually does, she has 45% on event, which is uh, really, really crazy. Um, so yeah, that's really good. The other reason is um, she can be played with invokers. Uh, basically, you want her to be using this ability as much as humanly possible. So invokers are really good for her. Um, this is another heavenly we want to take. Um, yeah, invokers are really good with her. Uh, do we level up? I think we level up, right? We might as well get this extra heavenly in here. Uh, yeah, sorry, the Invokers are really good for her. Um, Arcanist is really good for her as well, just because if you can get like six Arcanists with her, you're giving her 50 AP as well, which is good. And you have a lot of tanks with the Arcanists. You can get an Annie um, as well. Pretty much Annie and Diana go together really, really well. They use the same items, which is kind of suck, but they they do really good damage together. They're both super tanky, and you know they survive almost everything. So that's the really good part about both of them. Um, so that's why I like them uh, together. Annie is just also one of the best units you can buy, I guess, right? So can't can't say no to that. I'm gonna put these here because they will um, they will turn into other one costs, and that's what I need. Uh, please one shot those guys, would you? No, you did not. That's fine. Would like would like a Morello's on uh, on Soraka. It's super powerful on her, but um, I don't know that I'll be that lucky. We need, we need other things before we're likely to get that, so. Okay, this is good. I think I'll put this in instead of this, and this instead of this. Uh, the heavenly bonuses, if you don't know, this is kind of like the guild bonus uh, before. Um, the Kha'Zix gives you 10 crit, but that's not really what you want. The Malphite's super important, the Nico's super important, the Soraka is super important. Uh, the Wukong is actually really good as well, and the Emblem is obviously really good. Um, I'm actually going to clear this. I'm going to put our new team in here. I want to make sure that we get everything in. Uh, we want Diana, Soraka. We probably want to put Annie in, uh, although I don't know what we do for Invoker. Um, who's our other one? Yeah, Wukong, that's right, that's the last one. We need the emblem as well, that'll be on the Diana, so we'll have seven. I think we probably go Sage here, so we'll probably want to get the Morgana. Um, and we might even get the Zyra in, to be honest, if we're level 10. But that's that's level 10 stuff, we're, you know, we're not there yet, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, <clears throat> okay, some really good items. We got the Heavenly Emblem, so we'll definitely put that on. And now we sort of have some flex as to what we want to do. I think a Titans is really good on her. We we kind of want a lot of AP with her is the thing. Titans gives you tank. It gives you, you know, attack damage. It's pretty much everything that you want. Um, so I am going to slam that on her. We only have a one star. So, you know, I don't have uh, great items on her. I'm actually going to slam this as well. Oops, on the Nico. Um, I think that's really good on her. We basically need to pump up this Diana as much as we can because she's only a one star right now. We don't need to see that. We can keep leveling up. Oh, I had that because of this. Yeah, we're going to try and get these, but these are only one cost units, so I don't care about you know, them too much. Uh, yeah, Diana is super good. This uh, crown guard is really, really good. If I get a second crown guard, I'll definitely put it on uh, Nico. And then if I get a third one, I'll definitely put it on Annie. I don't know that we're going to fit any in this, uh, to be honest. Um, she's not that great. Partial Ascension could be really good. Um, this is also really good. Keepers is really good because we're going to have a bunch of units that are you know, together. I don't think I want Tiny Titans. Eight damage gives you two gold. I mean, that's really good too. Partial Ascension is really good, but... Are we going to be there long enough? I think 30% is not worth it. Okay, Pandora's is really good, but we kind of have all the stuff we need. I think I'm actually going to take Pandora's. The reason is we'll get more items, and as we get more items, uh, we will just be doing better. Uh, we'll put this Kha'Zix in now for the six Heavenly. We'll also take this. I'm also going to roll. Oh, that's amazingly good. There's a four cost there, a three cost here. And I guess I'll put a two cost here. Uh, I'd like to roll this because if we do get an Annie early, that's just, you know, it's super, super good. Edge of Night, not really what we're looking for. It might be good on Wukong, I guess, but 
I'd rather have some more tank stuff. Basically, we want to make Diana the star of this show, right? She's the she's the reason we're all here. She's the star. So I don't want to, you know, make somebody so overpowered in the back that you know, that she becomes useless or she becomes uh, a nobody. But Annie is really good. So if we get an Annie, we'll take it. Because Annie like has nothing to do with our comp, but it's fine. Uh, I'm gonna take her out for now, if you know, just because we may not use her long term. Uh, okay, this is a Lilia. That's really good. But again, Invoker. Like, ah, I don't know how to don't know how to get that into the comp. It just doesn't work with Heavenly, unfortunately. Gargoyles. Uh, I think the Crown Guard is better. I think the Crown Guard is better. I'm gonna go Crown Guard. We're gonna put Diana right in the middle here. Put the Kha'Zix and the Kiana over there, I guess. We're just trying to get to level 7 as fast as we can. Crown Guard on her is really good because she gets the um, full benefit of it. Um, her shield, obviously, is really good when she's first starting. Uh, and then she also gets... Everything is based on AP for her. So having extra AP just means she's going to be that much stronger. Uh, this guy's got a Yasuo with a Heavenly Emblem. That's pretty cool. Maybe going Fated Heavenly? I don't really know. This is... Morellos for some purpose. I'm not really sure. Not good on Syndra, so I don't know why you'd have it, but that's fine. I can't read your mind. I don't know what you're going. Pandora's items here is probably a really weak pick. I, in all honesty, I probably should have picked something a little bit better, but um, it's fine. The Heavenly... Oh, this would... Can I get this Diana? That would be amazing. Nope, the first person grabs it, of course, because I said I wanted it. I don't know what is it is. I swear, go watch my videos, guys. Every single time I say, oh, that would be a good character for me, uh, somebody takes it. It's it's actually kind of wild. I'm going to get this three cost just for the three gold. Um, the items are irrelevant because, of course, I have Pandora, so they'll eventually turn into what I want. Uh, I really would have liked that Diana, though, because that's all I really want. That's all I wanted for Christmas was a Diana. Um, we'll keep the Nico. Galio is nice, but uh, yeah, we're not using that. We will roll this. I'm actually going to roll a little tiny bit here, which I know seems crazy. Uh, we have another four cost, though. I think we roll that, right? We actually just keep leveling up. We need to get to seven is what we need, so it's fine. Uh, we do need some heal cut in this comp. We don't have any. Is Sunfire worth it? Sunfire, I think, is worth it. We don't. We usually have Annie. I, I don't think we have a place for Annie in here. There's just not... This might be the only exception to the Annie rule where Annie is really good. The reason Annie is really good is because, A, she's just like an SS++, you know, kind of unit. She's amazing. Uh, but she also has that heal cut on her, so her, her AoE damage that she does... Um, you know, it, it has the it has the wound function on it, which is of course super important. But that can be, you know, we can we can just get a unit <coughs> or, or an item and basically get that as well. So it's fine. I I feel like we're not losing too much by taking that and not getting the any and just getting the sunfire. Um, if we can three star Nico, she's obviously going to be super good as well. So uh, I don't know if that'll happen or not, but that's fine. Uh, we're zero of these remaining, so we actually don't need these. We can actually level up. And we can put something else in. We have all of these units, though. I don't know what we want to put in. Maybe some extra tank, but I don't really know. We have nothing else to put in. We need to find a Wukong as the next thing. Uh, or an Altruist, maybe? Yeah, because we get... we get Our armor magic resist is really good. We could also go Sage, which would be really nice. This is where we might get the Zyra in until we get, you know, the Wukong. Um... <coughs> Yeah, Morgana or Zyra, either one of these would be really good to get in. We just need to, need to find them. Don't think we're three-starring these. We're not going to be rolling at six, uh, obviously. We, we, we went right past it, so I'm probably selling these guys, but, you know, actually all four of these we're probably selling. But that's okay, we'll keep it for now. Um, we do need a two-star of this. This is two-star already. These are two-stars, so, yeah. We may not keep those, but we'll, we'll keep them for now. We're also looking for... Oh, Janna is good. This gives us two Dragon Lord, which is, you know, better than nothing. Um, <coughs> I think we put this here. We are going to want to get 
a... Okay, that's good, and that's really good. Uh, we are going to want to get... Uh, whatchamacallit? Um, a crown guard, so... If we can get a crown guard, we will take it. I don't know what this is. Not crown guard, okay. Adaptive helmet is actually also really good, but we already put that on, so that's fine. Okay, there's the Kiana. We still have 63 gold. Diana, good, 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 good. We take more of those. Good, Zyra. I think we put the Zyra in. Oh, no, Janna's two-star, though. Yeah, I think we, we keep that in. Um, <clears throat> I could go Static Shift. That gives me some AP cut as well, since we don't have... Or I could put Ionic Spark here. I could put Ionic Spark. Hmm... Yeah, she's tanky enough. Let's just put the Ionic Spark. And let's put a Static Shiv here. Okay, that's what we're going to do. We have a lot of Shred. We've got more damage. She attacks faster. I think it's all fine. Remember, staying strong is good. We want to stay as strong as possible. Uh, do we want to invoke her in? We have a Janna. But we're probably not keeping this Janna, so... Yeah, we'll leave it. Um, <clears throat> we just need the Wukong now. And we will have the seven, seventh heaven, seven heavenly, seventh heavenly. Uh, reinforcement. What's my four cost? Really, just more Ghana, right? I mean, that's not really worth it. That's not my main thing. This is a heavenly crest. That would have been nice earlier. Now, could I put this on Morgana? Say we could. Oh, 66 health for all our three costs. Oh, we only have two three costs. The last game I played, we had like four or five three costs. So that would have been really good. This is also pretty good. Oh, this health shield is really good too because we actually we're stacking quite a bit of units here. 44 health, 44 four mana. I think it's keepers. Oh, and there's our any. Oh my god. Okay, I think we put this over here so that we get the biggest uh, shield possible. Actually, we go like this. <coughs> I need to reverse those, but that's fine. Yeah, we got the Zyra, got the Annie, but I got it's we're we're just not we're just not using you. I'm really sorry. I'm not using you. There's the Zyra, Kiana. I mean, we're not really getting Kiana, right? It's not gonna happen probably. Uh, okay, we'll take the Zyra too. I mean, three star Zyra is really good. She's a backline unit. <coughs> we just I I don't think we have space for her in the comp. That's the problem. I just don't think she's don't think she's part of the comp, man. I don't know how to make you work. This is really good. This this heavenly is actually really good. The thing is, everybody is strong in this whole you know comp because because heavenly is just strong, right? Uh, artifact anvil. I need a remover though. Do I want to spend twenty two gold on it? I don't think so. I've got all the stuff I want. I think I do nothing. I just keep my gold. Yeah. A boot. I got a boot. I've never done that before, so I didn't know what to expect, but I got a boot. Yeah, I need to keep my money because what I really want is those. I want Diana's. Right? Yeah. Okay. This goes away. I mean, we almost have. But I don't think there's a way that we keep Zyra instead of Morgana, right? So let's just sell these. Let's just not go down that road anymore. Um, who do we not need? We don't need any more. Uh, Zyra's. We probably don't need Kha'Zix or Malphite. We de definitely don't need Kha'Zix. Malphite, we actually have six Malphites, so we we might three-star the Malphite. Okay, this is fine. She is uh, doing really, really well. I got the Talisman of Ascension last game, which gives you that 100% bonus on health and 120% bonus in damage after 120, or after 22 seconds. The problem is, it only popped once, and it popped as I was, like, doing my last attack. Wow, Soraka's actually doing really good in damage. That's crazy. But look at this. Diana's tanking a billion and a half damage, which is, of course, really good as well. Uh, I want a Wukong, but there's not one here. That's unfortunate. I don't really know what else to get. I, I mean, I guess a Morgana item would be good, a Soraka item, anything with mana. I mean, honestly, any of these is fine. The four cost is probably the best, just so I can make money, but... I'm last pick, so I don't really get to choose that. I'm going to take this. Looks like that's what he wanted, so 
that's what I take. <laughs> Just being a jerk. Sorry, man. Sorry, buddy. That is what you wanted. Ah, Dragon Lord is so good right now. Uh, I think I put this on the Soraka. She's doing really, really well. I don't think we're three-starring her, but I never really know. So, well, see, what did I, what did I just say? Wow. Okay. Uh, I don't know if we're three-starring this Diana. See? Ha ha ha! We got that too. All right, that worked. The the hacks. I think um, Mort Dog said he was watching my stream earlier so I think he's probably watching and he's just giving me the stuff that I want I appreciate you Mork Dog thanks for hitting me fam I appreciate it look at that shield holy crap she got a massive shield there that was great the Keepers is really good Keepers is really good with um, um, Yone not Yone um, Yasuo because Yasuo does extra damage when he's shielded and he just stays shielded like the whole game I had a really good uh, faded game with Yasuo where he was like basically the whole game he was uh, he was shielded it was pretty good <coughs> oh, that guy beat us. Is he seven? Uh, what is he? Cougar XX Cougar XX. No, he's only five. Mythic. Oh, three trick shot though, I guess. Okay. It's fine. Once we three start Diana, you just can't kill her. It's impossible. Okay. Morgana. Shall I prove Are we right? switching this over? I think so, right? Janet is not that good. <coughs> I, I take that back. Janet is good. Janet is good, but Morgana is better. Morgana is better. Morgana gives us the Sage, which gives us the Omnivamp and gives everybody back here some more AP. I think that's super important. Um, I would like to go like a 5 Sage, uh, because then we get 45% Omnivamp, which is insane on Diana. She, she actually does quite a bit of damage, but um, yeah, we're not, we're not doing that for now. Look at the shield. She's not taking damage. She heals so much. Look at that. Full health. 702. We don't have any, we don't have the, the, the best AP stats, but like she's tanking this whole team, well, this whole Darius anyway, uh, not Darius, Garen, um, while the team, you know, kills the rest of the units. So yeah, this is super good. Not high on damage, but again, she's the tank in this. This is the flex, right? We have to flex with what we can get. Are we keeping this? I think I would like to put her in there. Oh, is that one more? Oh, dude, really? Okay, yeah, we don't need this. Some call me evil. Shall yes, I prove nice. them right? That's really good. <clears throat> uh, I think we're letting go of this, Nico. That's just not happening. That's never happening. Uh, what would we like here? Probably Jewel Gauntlet. Uh, Arch. Uh, actually, it's Archmage, because I don't think her heal. So, she does this. Uh... Oh, no, she doesn't actually heal. Each time you always gain eight ability power from the rest of combat. Yeah, she doesn't actually heal. Okay, so the crit might be good on her then. I could do that. Uh, or I could go Cran Guard. <laughs> but I don't really want that. <clears throat> so I could go this or I could go crit. I mean. Or I could get. I could get a. Uh, a hex tech, and I could heal people. Let me take this and think about it for a sec. Do I want to heal everybody? I mean, who doesn't want to heal everybody, right? Uh, can we get the units that I'm looking for, please? Wow, this is. Wow, that's ridiculous. Wow, what? <clears throat> I think. I think, I think that the healing is worth it. Nico is pretty low. She's not three star. I think waiting and getting the uh, hex tech is probably okay. The other thing is Ginsu's is probably pretty good on her too, because then she would just she'd be attacking a lot faster. Uh, we don't need any more Kianas. We're gonna take that out. We don't need Sorakas. We're gonna take that out. Uh, we just need to find some of these units. Okay, Malphite's actually pretty good. I'll take that. Hui. We could take Huey and we could. Uh... Do I take Ginsu's? I think I take Ginsu's. Uh, we could get Huey in. We would lose a Heavenly. But he would basically print us units, right? He would print us Dianas and we could level up. We only need two more Dianas, so we're not losing that much by putting him in. I think that's fine. 
Uh, Morgana, what does she need? She wants the heal cut, but we already have heal cut here. So is that really that important? Probably not. Oh wow, this team is insane. I think we got them, but man. Dude, that was so close. That wasn't even funny. That was so close. It was not cool, dude. Alright. Go Dianas. I mean, I'm still gonna try and get Diana here. Dude, we got it. Okay, two more rounds. And we're good. <coughs> we're gonna stop there. Do we put more tank items on is the question. No, I don't think so. We actually don't need this Kha'Zix because I really don't care how much she crits. Um, her crits are... I wish we got better breakdown on the damage. Um... Yeah, I wish I had better damage breakdowns for this, but this is fine. Two more two more rounds, and we get a free three cost. That's awesome. So now all of our gold is going into leveling up. So we can get the Zyra in, we can get three Sage, then we get the Wukong in. We basically want to go to level nine and just win that way. That's our win condition. Is level nine, seven heavenly. Boom. Actually, we have to get the Kha'Zix in. Oh, no, but once, we, once the Hoya is done, the Kha'Zix goes back in. Yeah, we just need level nine. Uh, actually, we just need level eight. Because Kha'Zix go in for there, and then level 8, we hopefully find a Wukong. So yeah, we only need level 8. Level 9 would be like, we get this in or something like that, I don't know. Uh, what do I want here? That would have been really nice. I think we take this. I think it's just worth it to have the 5 gold, the 5 cost. And, you know, the, this is pretty good. The Archangel is, is pretty good, so I think I'll take it. Um, Morgana, okay. Shall I prove them right? Who does this go on, though? I, actually, I need Wukong items. I'm going to put this there, but I need Wukong items. I, I don't actually need anything else. Don't think we're three-starring this, right? I mean, what are the chances? Pretty low, right? I just want to level up. Just want to level up. Uh, we're not going to three-star this either, but that's fine. And we're not even going to use this Zyra. Unless we go level 9, I guess. And with level 9, I'd probably rather put someone else in. No, I think that is still pretty good. Four, four Sage would be really nice. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep her. I, I'm not in need of gold or anything, so this is fine. If we can just survive, we, we'll be okay. Uh, do we win? Oh god, you hit the wrong units, you dummy. Let's find these nuts. Alright, now we got a three star. Uh, three star. There we go. Take you out, put you back in. Dragon's Claw, not what we need. We need Wukong items. I'm gonna actually give this to the Riven. And get the Zyra in. Three Sage. Amazing. Just need a Wukong now, please. Can we get a Wukong? No. We can't get Wukong. And that's okay. I appreciate you. Maybe Dragonlord is better. Two Dragonlord? Dragonlord late is really good because you do so much. Like, you do 15% of their damage at 5, which is crazy. Uh, but I think the Sage is better. We give her... Um, we have, yeah, 20% Omni Vamp now as well on this Diana. Although, if she gets uh, CC'd like that, that's not ideal. Come on, heal. Come on, heal. Heal, heal, heal. Look how much she's healing for. Come on, heal. Oh, you almost got it. Ah, oh, dude. That team is really hard. XX Cougar XX. I remember when I used to name things like that. Remember when we were, like, young and dumb like that? <laughs> I remember. Uh, we really need a better tank. This is why Annie is nice, because Annie provides that tank that you don't get when you're going Diana. Like, Diana's a good tank, don't get me wrong. But we've had to waste one item on Heavenly. We've had to use two tank items, and she's still not a great tank. Like, uh, no, okay, I'll take that back. She is a great tank. Um, but <laughs> she's not the best. Two-star Janet, or three-star Janet, is probably better than the three-star Soraka, just because you're going to be healing her so much more. Oh, Hand of Justice, I actually want to keep that, right? That's, that's really good. I want to keep that. Set? Hmm. Are you good, Set? Oh, Thief's Gloves on him? Is that better? No, because I can give him two, at least two items that he really likes, right? Okay, now we'll take the Nikos. Come on, three-star Nico, can we make that happen, guys? 
Guys, come on. What's going on here? What is going on? We're only level 8. We're not getting that many. That many, yeah. 3 costs. Or 5 costs, rather. That's the problem. We need level 9 to reliably get that. Now Diana can shine. What's this? 1v9. 1v9, Diana. Keep healing. Keep healing. Oh god, you're gonna die. Oh god, we're all dead. Uh, this is a really good uh, comp, too. Who is this? Is this a... Jesus, was that a, uh, a ghost we just fought? That's a heavenly team, too, right? Yeah, that was. That's that's this guy here. He's also seven heavenly. Well, he's seven heavenly. He actually has his Wukong. Ugh. Feels bad, man. Need to get that Wukong. Come on, Wukong. Stick to the plan. We have a plan? No. 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 Okay. <laughs> Terrible. I mean, we're still third place, at the very least. I think that's really good. Uh, we got all the items that we want. We just, we low rolled on this Wukong, really, unfortunately. I mean, it is only a 3% chance, so I get it. We're only level 8. Uh, but, like, I, I rolled, like, 60 gold. We should have got something. If we make it to Carousel, we might have a chance. But I think both of these guys beat us easily. I think it's going to be very difficult to win. I need to reposition, probably, to get some better angles. Let's see if we can get the Wukong here. Oh god. Okay, no Wukong. Okay, let's do this then. Actually, let's take this. Let's see if we can get anything good here. Thief's Gloves. I think we put it on her and we just hope for the best. Uh, this will put on you. This will put on you. Good luck, team. Godspeed. I'm saluting you, team. Three star Bard, though. Like, Good lord. Bard is still really good. I, I still like Bard. I don't know about that last whisper on him, but that's fine. I guess it's good, because he's wrecking our face. Oh, that, that CC is so horrendous for us. Alright, guys. This was another good video. Um, you know, third place. I think it's fine. Um, it's not first. I get that. But this is a Diana Flex. This is what you can look like when you go Heavenly. It's good. Heavenly is really good. Uh, it's, uh, it's strong. She's really strong. Um, maybe some better items would have been good. We kind of didn't get it exactly what we want, and we really low rolled on our units, which sucks. But yeah, good game, guys. I uh, hope you watch my next video. I've got a bunch of these videos on how to play uh, Diana Flex, so watch the next, and we'll see you next time. Bye.